Hey there, um, I had upgraded to Mozilla Firefox 3 just recently and um, well, I am quite satisfied with it. It's fast, it's safe. Um, the only thing that bothered me is um, the tab effect add-on. You know, when you switch um, to or with your tabs doesn't give me this cool 3D um, cube effect anymore so it's kinda sad anyway whoever is the dude who made that I do hope you have an updated version because um, that extension is really cool anyway um, with this Mozilla Firefox 3 there's a cool extension that was well shared with me by one of my subscribers um, it's from Attila339 and it says here hey I was surfing and found an amazing Firefox extension it's called any color and I thought you might want to check it out and I had checked it out I had downloaded it and as you can see my Firefox looks different because I used um, any color I must say this extension is really cool and it helped me bounce back because I'm really sad the tab effect doesn't work anymore anyway so if you had downloaded um, any color just go to tools and then go to any color and then the any color window should pop up like so so you go to appearance so here you can change the background color highlight color text color but what amazes me is this one so the header which is this part and the footer, the footer, which is this part, can be customized. So the background of this part and this part can be changed. So I think that's really cool. So you go to image URL, browse for your image. So I'm just going to use one of my wallpapers. You can create your wallpapers using GIMP. Um, I had already um, done a video about that. You might want to check it out to so anyway I'm gonna change my wallpaper or my background to this one so that's my header and my footer so I'm gonna change it as well with the same wallpaper like so so make sure your text color is the opposite of your image or the color of your image so in my case I have to change this to white like so and this one as well let me do that again there we go so if you're satisfied with your settings just hit OK and the changes should take effect immediately like so so I think that's really cool also if you want to use uh, smaller pictures because obviously this is a large picture because it's a wallpaper let's say I'm gonna use my new avatar if you had noticed I had changed my avatar hope you liked it uh, so I'm gonna browse for the image here we go I'm gonna browse for my icons and here we are so this picture is a bit small, so you can change the position of your image. I'm going to place it at the center, so if you're satisfied, just hit OK. And it should look like this one. There you go. So there's my image. If you want it to be repeated rather than staying at the center, you can also do that so we go back to the window this time we check the image repeat like so and then hit OK and it should look like this one so I think that's really nice so other options include let's say you go to presets so you have other um, themes here you can choose from let's say I want to use frozen load 
hit OK, and there you go. That's frozen. You can also create your own theme by hitting New. Enter a name for the preset, let's say Geeky. Hit OK. And then um, with Geeky, all you have to do is change the appearance, change your background, go to preset, hit Geeky, click Save. And there you go. When you go to Geeky, um, your saved settings um, should um, take effect. You can also choose advanced so you can change the font size from normal to humongous. Okay, let's just check that out. There you go. And this is um, large or bigger. So, anyway. So that is the Farfax extension that I want to share. Again, thanks to Attila339 for sharing that. Also, to all my subscribers, thank you for the sub. If you have any question at all about my videos and other things related, please do message me and I'll get to answer them right away as soon as I can. And also, you might want to check out my YouTube partners. Um, they're on my channel. So there you go, a quick video for you, more to come, and as always, just have fun.